Microsoft recently announced their latest version of their operating system, Windows 11, with new features and a new user interface. It'll be a free upgrade if you have Windows 10 and is expected to be released in the fall later this year. While Windows 11 is a free upgrade for Windows 10 users, your computer must meet the basic requirements to install it, including having a 1 GHz processor or faster, 4 GB of RAM, and 64 GB or larger of storage. In addition, without getting too technical, your PC must also have a trusted platform module, sometimes referred to as a TPM chip that stores tamper-resistant encryption keys on your computer. To find out if your computer has a TPM, let's open the TPM Management Tool. Go to the search box in the lower left and type tpm.msc. Select it. If you get an overview, along with TPM manufacturer information, your computer does have a TPM chip. Just make sure here on the right, it's version 2. Version 1 will not be supported when Windows 11 releases. Otherwise, if you get a message that says compatible TPM cannot be found, you will need to get a new computer with a TPM chip on the motherboard to run Windows 11. In addition, Microsoft has updated their PC Health Check app to let you know if your computer meets all the system requirements to run Windows 11. To download the PC Health Check app, go to the address bar and type aka.ms slash getpc health check app. And then hit enter on your keyboard. This will now download the file to your computer. It's made by Microsoft and completely safe. If you get this message, click on keep. Now go find the file you downloaded and open it. Go accept the terms of the license agreement and select install. If it's not selected, check the box next to open Windows PC Health Check. And then click on finish. You'll now see various information about your computer. Here at the top, click the check now button to find out if your computer meets the system requirements for Windows 11. If it can, hopefully you get this message that says this PC can run Windows 11, meaning your PC meets all the requirements. Otherwise, you'll sadly get a message that states this PC can't run Windows 11. If you don't want to upgrade or buy a new computer, Windows 10 thankfully will be supported through October 14th of 2025, so there's no hurry to upgrade yet. Thanks for watching. If this video is useful for you, give it a thumbs up. All links, including the download link to the PC Health Check app, are located in the description. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay up to date with the latest on Windows 11 and other tech-related stuff here on Tech Gumbo.